Hello, my name is Ila, and today I will be introducing SIGBOT's dual sensors. SIGBOT researches sensors that recognize 3D environments and provides information to robots that recognize space. It can be applied to service robots, smart toys, etc. to realize precise SLAM technology and can be applied as a safety sensor in the smart factory field. SIGBOT uses this to research various application devices and algorithmic technologies. SIG LiDAR D1, the flagship product of SIGBOT, is the world's first dual LiDAR and is a low-cost, high-performance product that can recognize 2D and 3D at the same time. We are currently in the process of mass-producing and selling and are developing LiDAR for industrial and autonomous driving. SIGBOT was founded in 2019. They do not only manufacture, but they research and develop this product. This product uses 2D and 3D sensors simultaneously and uses precise SLAM technology. LiDAR stands for Light Detection and Ranging. It creates a 3D representation of the environment. It knows what's going on and what it is. It uses laser beams to map, but they are safe to the eyes. Korea's first mass-produced sensor is the SIG LiDAR D1. It has a LiDAR sensor for mobile robots, cleaning robots, and smart toy sensors. It recognizes gestures. The LiDAR is ultra small, 37.4 by 37.4 by 24.5 millimeters, so that it can be used for relatively small drones and robot vacuum cleaners to industrial mobile robots without restrictions. It elaborately recognizes the external environment with 3D data and the 2D data enables long distance measurements. The function of 2D LiDAR, which can recognize the distance of 8 meters, and 3D LiDAR, which recognizes the surroundings within 2 meters, can be applied to various robots by implementing it in one module. And the robot's slam and obstacle avoidance functions are possible at the same time. It is a fixed type. It does not move, only scans. Using the solid state method without the driving part, durability problems such as heat generation and vibration are improved, and the LiDAR due to the internal motor is made ultra small. Since it runs in the form of solid state rather than scanning the laser, there is no vibration, heat, or noise. Since a wide viewing angle is secured by the wide angle lens, it is not necessary to operate the light emitting unit like laser or LED for a long time and heat generation of the light emitting unit may be reduced. It can detect movement, not only mapping. It is small and other sensors are big and cannot be used for small devices, but these can be used for small and big devices. 3D has HD mapping within 2 meters. 2D is less detailed, but mapping goes up to 8 meters for a wide range. SLAM stands for Simultaneously Localization and Mapping. When you're mapping the environments, it's hard to map yourself in the environment, but this machine solves this issue with the dual LiDAR. It is a solid state LiDAR, which means the sensor does not have moving parts inside of it. It stands and scans. It does not vibrate, overheat. It is quiet and more durable, so it lasts longer. It is small, so it is less heavy. Even though it has all of these perks, it is still cheap and easy to install. It is ultra small compared to other companies' products. It is durable and cheaper because it does not have a mechanical drive unit. The H2 is the same but bigger and used for automated vehicles like self-driving cars or vehicle detection. 
It is also used for industrial logistics robots, delivery robots, serving robots, and includes all the things D1 has. Examples of uses are automatic parking systems and vehicle danger detection LIDAR. 2D and 3D simultaneous measurements enable robots slam and obstacle avoidance simultaneously. Low power and miniaturization technology suitable for industrial logistics robots, delivery robots, and serving robots with a wide angle of view and high resolution. As technology advances, these sensors are being used more frequently. Thank you.